All right, uh, hey guys, how's it going? It's Saturday, October 24th, 2020 at 5.30 p.m. Um, I'm just gonna do a topic on something that just really gets under my skin. And that is um, when people like assume I'm a mind reader. Now, I fucking hate when people assume that, like, like that I'm a mind reader or whatever. It's like, I don't know. This is gonna be a bad video. But there's just something that really pisses me off because, um, I just hate when people do this shit. Like, they expect me to, like, to do something, but I actually don't, and then they get all pissy with me, but I don't know about. I just hate that shit. Mm. I just got this, uh, in my head or whatever. Um, I tweeted that out, like, on October 21st, because that's just something that really pisses me off. Like, I don't know. It's gonna be a bad video, but I just have to do a rant on this. Um, I remember this some um, two up epi this one episode of the middle where Axel was like punished for like leaving his socks everywhere in the house. So basically, Mike gets fed up with it or whatever, and um, then he takes away his last basketball game or whatever. And one point of the episode, he was like. Something to do with the rain gutters or whatever, like, on the house. Or having his plate, like, two inches by the sink or whatever. And when they got to the school um, to play basketball, like, for Axel's team, um, he basically, like, uh, Mike, the dad, said, uh, if you just moved the plate into the sink, I would have let you play tonight. And Axel was like, why didn't you say something? You know, just for, like, teach him a lesson or whatever, because he kept... Um, dissing his dad rules about leaving his socks around. He said something like that. I don't remember that. I haven't watched that episode, in, that show in a while, but just something like that. And Axel was like, well, sorry, I'm not a mind reader. Yeah. That, I felt that one too, because I just hate when people do that. Like, they assume, like, like, they think, like, if, the, if I do something for them, they'll do something big for me. And I don't. Um, and yeah, they just don't care or they just get pissy with me. I just hate when people do that. You know, the, tell me if you want me to do something for you, then I'll do it. I'm not a mind reader. I don't know. Let me start learning the video. Oh, geez, only like, almost three minutes in. But anyways, um... There ain't that much to talk about. I don't know. I don't have. I don't know that much to say. This is a bad video, but you know, I just have to get this off my chest because this really pisses me off. Um, I'm pretty sure a lot of people get pissed off by this too. Everyone just assumes they're mind readers, and yeah. God, I just feel like I just told just one reference or whatever. But no, no, no. There's just something that pisses me off. So. Yeah. Um, don't expect, like... It also sucks, like, when, um... You know, you're in a relationship, too, and the boyfriend... Uh, and the girlfriend, like, always expects, like, the the boyfriend to be, like... Uh, like her... Like a mind reader or whatever. Like, oh, she might like this, um... She probably wants me, like, bigger. But it doesn't really happen. She gets all disappointed and possibly breaks up with him. You know? Jeez. Like, I don't know what else to say about this. Just, um, don't expect, like, everyone to be, like, a mind reader because of something, like, you want them to do. Just let them know. Oh, I want you to do this. Let them know. Because they're not always going to be, like, know what you want or whatever unless you tell them, you know? So, yeah. That's just what I have to say about this. Um... Yeah, I also hate when they get pissed with me too. Like, don't get my, it's not my fault. You, you, you didn't tell me, so stop blaming it on me. But anyways, um, yeah, that's why I have to say about this video, guys. Um, have a good rest of your day.